Distinguished guests, good afternoon. It is my pleasure to be invited to the appreciation lunch of NUS Teach Singapore or Teach SG. Due to my official duties overseas, I regret not being able to join you in person to celebrate the contributions by NUS mentors and the philanthropic endeavors of community donors. We are gathered here today because we believe that every child should have every opportunity to succeed, regardless of their background. The government has long committed to uplifting Singaporeans from disadvantaged circumstances. To better support students from vulnerable backgrounds, the Ministry of Education, or MOE, has focused resources towards after-school programs that support their social, physical, and emotional development. We have set up student care centres in all 182 primary schools to provide care and support for students after school. Schools proactively reach out to parents of low-income families to enrol their children. Similarly, since 2019, about 120 secondary schools have set up after-school programs under Gear Up, which focuses on befriending and mentoring by trusted adults, peer support and relationships, and interest-based activities to engage vulnerable students. These structured after-school spaces are additional platforms to provide our students with learning experiences through programs such as Teach SG to broaden their worldview and support their holistic development. Just as importantly, the wider community must lean forward to safeguard our social mobility and strengthen our social compact. While schools and teachers are already providing support for students from vulnerable backgrounds, there is room for additional support from the community. I'm heartened to see more members in our society stepping forward in this collective effort. Teach SG is one such example. Through the generous support from donors and the dedication of time by NUS mentors, the program has connected with 106 community partners since 2021, of which 23 are MOE schools, and will continue to serve more schools. Over a period of at least three months, Teach SG mentors provide academic support and out-of-classroom enrichment activities. All of you serve as positive role models to your younger charges, playing the role of big sisters and big brothers. You help them build confidence and inspire them to believe in themselves. By forging strong bonds over time, the values we impart and the guidance you offer to help these students discover their strengths and make their lives seem a little brighter and enable them to strive towards their aspirations. I believe that learning goes both ways and hope that the mentoring experience has been equally rewarding for all of you. One of NUS student mentors, Liu Yan Hang, shared how her experience as a mentor has enabled her to develop valuable skills such as active listening, communicating more empathetically, and facilitating different perspectives as she tried different ways to engage her mentee. I also look forward to the sharing by Colin, a mentor who has served for two cycles of Teach SG. My hope is that future batches of NUS mentors will continue to have similarly enriching experiences through Teach SG. In closing, I would like to express my appreciation once again to NUS and all the mentors for your devotion of time and energy to make a positive difference in the lives of these students. A big thank you too to the donors and community partners that have supported Teach SG and made this program possible. Thank you.